Savannah Marshall versus Maria Lindbergh. Who do you all think is going to win this fight? If you guys didn't know, this is the fight that we'll be seeing this weekend now. Uh, the fight is official. They recently announced it. Marshall Lindbergh this weekend on the 10th of April, just three days away as I'm making this video. Um, it replaced, uh, Lindbergh replaced Hermans. If you guys don't know Hermans, uh, one of her teammates or one of her trainers tested positive, and so they had to take out take her out of the event and uh, now uh, we have Marshall versus Lindbergh uh, Matrim put out a statement recently um, you know as it says update Savannah Marshall will now defend her WBO world middleweight title versus four-time world title challenger Maria Lindbergh this Saturday hashtag Maria Marshall Lindbergh hashtag Ben Vargas yeah, in the undercard of uh, Conor Brand versus Samuel Vargas to be shown live on the zone here in the States and Sky Sports in the UK. Savannah Marshall, we all know she is former Olympian, 9 0, 7 wins come by way of Nakar Tikio. She'll be defending her title, WBO middleweight title, in uh, this fight against Maria Lindbergh. 44 years old from Sweden, 19 6, 2 draws, 10 wins come by way of Nakar Tikio. Uh, she's fought the likes of Christina Hammer. Um, well, so I recognize Christina Hammer again, Marie Eve DeCare. Man, she's lost to every notable name that I know. Now, here she is, having not fought at all in 2020. Uh, she'll be fighting Savannah Marshall in Marshall's 10th professional fight. So, uh, I watched some footage of Lindbergh, and you know, she she's she's a good replacement she's a good replacement for last minute replacement just three days away from the fight but she's 44 years old and seven and marshall is young she's strong she's tall she's awkward I, I see her honestly just making this fight look easy um man she's five six and freaking savannah marshall is five eleven. Oh my goodness she's gonna tower over her big time <laughs> Uh, I, I see this fight being an easy fight. It's going to be an easy fight, in my opinion. Uh, right now, Savannah Marshall, is, is she she looks very unstoppable, in my opinion. I think I can't really think of a, a fighter right now that can give her a challenge other than Chris, uh, Clarissa Shields. I feel like she's the only one that can really challenge her and possibly beat her. Uh, anybody else, I, I see... I see Savannah Marshall just bullying and with her awkward style uh, and stopping them. And I definitely see her stopping uh, Lindbergh in this fight. So I'm just happy, man. I'm just happy they were able to find a replacement really fast. Um, you know, because the f like 24 hours ago, that's when we heard the news that the the fight got canceled. And the next thing you know, the next day we have we have ourselves a fight. So so yeah, it's awesome that uh, Matchroom well, were able to find somebody real fast. Um, you know, hopefully hopefully Lindbergh has been keeping in shape. You know, hopefully she's been in the gym. Uh, training uh, for something like this because uh, yeah it's after fighting for after not fighting for more than a year and now here she is just days away last minute fighting Marshall I'm not sure if Lindbergh had a fight prepared was I'm not sure if she was preparing for a fight or what have you but um but yeah it's uh it's gonna be interesting and I look forward to it so let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts. Who do you all think is going to win this one again? April 10, 2021 to be shown live on The Zone here in the States. Uh, Sky Sports in the UK in the undercard of Conor Band versus Samuel Vargas. Marshall TKO in round, I would say, 4 or 5. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for listening and watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.